come up here in the box with you, uh, talk about these 100 races we've got coming up, which I'm pretty excited for. We've got some pretty good quality fields here, a couple of internationals, which I'm looking forward to watching. And I think we're going to see some action on the track today. Yeah, it's good to have this kind of depth, to have, to have these C races down here. Obviously, there's the start list for the women's C. In lane three, Stephanie Pollard. Four, Nicole Berridge. Five, Brooke Summerfield. And in six, Sarah James. Now, we've already got our first international athlete, Brooke Summerfield from New Zealand. We'll see a lot of uh, New Zealand athletes and a lot of uh, Japanese athletes. Exactly. Obviously, we've got a, a couple of Olympians in these Japanese athletes. Yeah, Olympic medalists. Yeah, definitely. And they're obviously the quickest in the field over the, uh, the men's list. So we've got guys that are looking to go sub-10, which if we see that here in camera, I'm, obviously I don't know my history amazingly, so I won't, don't quote me on this, but I don't think we've seen a sub-10 race here in Canberra before. So if we get that here, I think that'll be pretty amazing. I reckon we can do a bit of a, a look-up, a look-see-up, and let's have a look. And we'll be able to find out if there was a sub-10 in Canberra. Yeah, it looks like uh, Ben Johnson, 10 flat, so we haven't. No, we haven't, and we might see that today. Even if it's windy, I don't care. There we go, off and running. Sarah James on the outside, out of blocks very well, but Nicole Berridge from New South Wales now. The Athletics East athlete, she's pulled herself into the lead, getting challenged by Pollard. Very close. Might have been a little bit of a late dip there from, uh, from Pollard. It's closing fast. The wind a minus 0 0.5. Let's hope it doesn't get too much more minus than that. We've seen some positives all, all afternoon, and we'd like it to probably keep, keep positive, I'd say.